Hello, and welcome to Mindful Mornings at Ellington High School. We recognize that this school year will have some unique challenges. It is important to know that each of us are navigating a new reality and to be gentle with ourselves and with one another. Each day during Mindful Mornings, we will be sharing with you a variety of strategies and techniques to help students and staff feel more at peace throughout the day. We encourage all of you to participate and experience the benefits of what mindfulness can bring to you. In this mindfulness strategy, you're gonna learn how to find your breath. Your body is always breathing and the breath is constantly moving. Your breath is not only the best place to start, but it is a constant that you can return to anytime you need a little centering. Today, you're gently gonna find the breath in your body. There's nothing to figure out. There are no problems to solve and there's nothing special you need to do. You're just gonna constantly return back to your body breathing. You are training your mind. You are growing the muscle, which is your brain, to bring your mind away from distraction using your breath. So right now, find a comfortable position for your body. Sitting is often recommended as it helps you keep your body awake because sometimes when I lie on the floor, I fall asleep. But you can also try lying flat on your back or standing. You might wanna sit on a yoga mat or a meditation cushion or your chair at school is just fine. Find what feels most comfortable and something that you can sustain for a few minutes. Now, gently allow the eyes to close. If you're more comfortable with the eyes open, that's fine too, but gaze at the floor or the ceiling or the desk in front of you. Allow your eyes to just relax and rest on a spot if your eyes are open. This helps you to minimize distractions in your practice. So bring your awareness to your abdomen again. Relaxing the muscles there, see if you can feel the natural rising and falling. Imagine the body is breathing itself from the navel around to the obliques and notice the movement with each breath. Take a few deep breaths like this. Now move your awareness up to the chest. As you inhale, tune into the expansion of the lungs and the rising of the chest. As you exhale, feel the contraction and movement. See if you can follow the feeling of the breath from the beginning of your inhalation through the end of your exhalation. Now bring your attention to your nostrils. The feeling of the breath may be more subtle here, but try taking a deep breath to see what is present for you. You might notice a slight tickle at the tip of your nose as you breathe in. You may notice the breath is slightly warmer on the way out.
Rest your awareness in the body breathing in one of these three spots. When your mind wanders, refocus on the direct experience of your breath. Continue to observe the breath and the rise and fall for a minute or two. Feeling the breath from the beginning of your inhalation all the way to the end of your exhalation. Feeling the expansion of your lungs and the rising of your chest. Maybe feeling the whistle of breath coming in through your nose. Feeling the breath coming out of your nose. When your mind wanders and thinks about something else, and it often does, come back to your experience of breathing. mindfulness and meditation is that constant ebb and flow of mind wandering you being present to see it and coming back to your breath the more you do that the stronger your brain will become you're actually Improving your brain's ability to focus. Your brain is a muscle. Take another few deep breaths in and out. Now we're gonna wrap up this last breath. Bring this awareness with you into your daily life. You can use this breath anytime you possibly need to, to come back to your present moment. Stay in touch with the breath in your body to help the mind remain in the present. mindfulness tip your mind is going to wander it's called the monkey mind your brain is designed to process information it's just doing its job so rather than seeing it as a problem approach it as an opportunity to strengthen your mindfulness skills And try to use, um, you know, some curiosity and forgiveness and patience to those moments when your mind does wander. And bring it back to your breath. How and when can you use this strategy today in your life? Have a great day.